Okay, we're gonna be looking at Slitaz uh, again here. Uh, we're gonna be looking at how to play music and videos from the command line. Uh, now, if you're using Slitaz Bass, uh, which is text only, you can listen to music and CDs, uh, but you need X installed to watch videos. So although I'm showing you how to use this from the command line, I do have a full desktop running for the video portion of it. First thing is, I mean, there's a, different applications you can use out there. I'm an M player fan, so we're going to install M player, which I already have installed, but you would use Taz PKG, and if you haven't done it in a while, you would recharge the list. I've already did that. Uh, now we need to get dash install M player, which I've also already done. So just do that. You have to be root to do that. So SU for root, and then uh, if you're running off the live CD, the default root password is root. Once M player is installed, you can play videos. Now, if I type in M player and the name of a video I have, which is an MP4 here, and I hit enter, it starts playing the audio, but I don't get any video. I think that's because I'm running in VirtualBox, but if for some reason you do that command and you don't see any video, it tells you right here, it says, try this. And it says to use dash VO, which I assume stands for video out, and it says to use X11. So we'll try it again, we'll go M player dash VO X11, that's a lowercase x, and the name of our video file, we'll hit enter there and voila, our video is playing. Once again, that just depends on your video setup. I'm sure you don't have to do that on every machine, but once again, if you don't see a video, then give that a try. Uh, and I believe if we hit F, F would go full screen once again, depends on your video setting. I'm running in a uh, virtual box here, so my video settings are a little different. And um, you can hit escape to get out of that, and it will kill the video there. Now, uh, you can do the same thing to play music. If you had some MP3 files, you would just say M player and the name of your MP3 file. Or you can play a bunch of MP3 files by using your little asterisk there, dot MP3. Now, if you have a CD player, which I'm running in VirtualBox here and I do not have a CD player hooked up, but I'm going to show you how to do it. It's actually very simple. M player, and then you do CD DA colon forward slash forward slash, and you could hit enter at that point, and it would play all the songs on the CD. Now, at any point you hit control C to end that, you can hit down page to jump to the next song. If you want to jump straight to a song, you do that same thing, but then put in the track number. So M player, CD, DA, colon, forward slash, forward slash. And let's say we want to go track four on the CD. We just hit four there and hit enter, and it would jump to track four on the CD. Once again, I don't have a CD-ROM drive hooked up here, so it's not playing it through this. But that is how you would play videos and music in Slitaz 3.0 from the command line um, using M Player. Once again, there's other tools out there. I like M Player. Uh, so give that a try, and I hope this helps, and I hope that you have a great day. And visit filmsbychris.com for more video tutorials like this.